Aspirates, this is How To UNF with Hannah Guile, and today we're going to be interviewing Bo Beach. For those of you who don't know who he is, he's one of UNF's star basketball players, and somehow we snagged an interview with him. So we're going to talk to him about his cool basketball career, and maybe he'll even show us some stuff. Let's go. Okay, so for all of us basketball newbies, can you give us kind of the basic rundown for basketball? Yeah, so you have the point guard, the shooting guard, the small forward, which is myself, okay. the power forward, and the center. That's the five basic positions of basketball. And basically from there, the object of the game is very difficult. You want to get the round ball, mm -hmm. normally orange or brown, okay. and you want to put it into the red circle. That's 10 feet high. That's the object of the game. So would you say that to stay in shape, it's like really rigorous? Um, yes and no. If you keep a good, bat, like a baseline, of conditioning it's not mm -hmm. that difficult but you know I mean if you get hurt for a couple weeks and you're out of it for two three weeks mm -hmm. then it becomes very very rigorous because sure. um, you're catching up trying to catch up to the rest of the team and it gets brutal quick right so staying healthy is key but also staying at a good baseline conditioning level is also very important like over summer mm -hmm. um, don't want to take any days off in the summer especially because it's easy to become complacent and relax and that's the last thing we want to do especially after last year's success we have to be even more on our toes so guys we're definitely working hard we have about six guys here over the summer working out every day so we had a good high level of conditioning for about three months right. which really prepared us for the month we're in now which where we're at full practices we're scrimmaging each other so we're in, us six we're in some good shape and not that the other guys aren't but they're in great shape as well the mm -hmm. whole team is really but you know just having that extra three months really helps build conditioning. Right. Do you guys see yourselves um, going farther than you did last year then? Um, I mean, I can't predict the future, but right. a goal, of course, for the team is to do better than last year. Last year was a great year, don't get me wrong. I'd love to do exactly what we did last year, but at the same time, to do more is always the goal. Right. Because going into last year, we had never done that before, so mm -hmm. that was the goal to do it. Now that we've done it, we have to do that and do more. Right. So the goal is just, like I said, just keep getting better every day and then when March comes, we'll see where, where we end up and how it goes, but I mean, we're working hard right now to do better than last year. So, I heard that you shoot the three-point shots in the game, is that correct? Yes, it is. I am a three-point specialist. Is there anything I need to know when shooting a free throw or a three-point? So, the big thing for me mm -hmm. is my form. Okay. So, in my form, I always want to make sure that I'm always square to the basket. Okay. So, my shoulders are always facing the rim. My feet are always facing the rim. I don't want to be turned sideways at any point. Mm -hmm. And that's just two fundamental things that I always think about every time I shoot the basketball. All right, well, thank you so much for teaching me how to do these awesome shots. I have to work on it a it's little right. bit. It's just the beginning, you'll do all right. All right, well, thank you so much. Okay, UNF, this has been How to Shoot Hoops with Hannah Guile, signing off.